Only one Democrat in the Texas Senate voted in favor of SB6, the so-called bathroom bill. Then the author of that bill helped allocate millions in funding for that Democrat's district. KXAN's Rachel Glazer asked him if the money had anything to do with the vote. Senator Eddie Lucio says he voted on principle, not party. It's always a matter of doing what's right, um, approach it in a very Christian way. The day after the Senate passed Senate Bill 6, the bill's author, Republican Senator Lois Kolkhorst, co-sponsored a rider to set aside $5 million in the upper chamber's budget to fund a project in Lucio's district. Since then, Lucio has come under fire from reports claiming he sold his vote. Oh, no, 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 no. That was not anywhere part of the discussion at any time and no one can tell you that I have ever plotted or schemed on anything. The executive director of the Democratic Party of Texas, Manny Garcia, points out SB6 is a far step away from the party's platform. Uh, so it's against the core value of our Democratic Party. We believe that every single person ought to be able to live freely in Texas. He also says lawmakers are free to vote as they please. Well, I think a number of Democrats have expressed their concerns to the senator. SB6 would require people use the public restroom that matches their biological sex at government government buildings and public schools and universities. As for the $5 million, it's going toward a center for urban ecology at a nature and birding center in McAllen. An opportunity to free economic development, an opportunity preservation of the environment. Senator Colcourt's office says it's common practice for a member of the Senate Finance Committee to help other senators secure funding. Rachel Glazer, KXAN News. Senate Bill 6 passed the Senate with a 20 to 10 vote, two more than it needed to advance to the House. It would have passed the Republican-controlled chamber without support from Senator Lucio.